improve air quality, 25 Pennsylvania counties require vehicle emissions testing every year, including most mid-state counties. But are they really necessary, especially for newer vehicles? One state senator says no, and a lot of his colleagues agree. Here's Dennis Owens. New and newish cars need to pass emissions tests, and the price of that sticker? About 40 bucks a year. I don't. I don't think it serves any legitimate purpose. Senate it's Transportation Chairman Wayne Langerholk's SB 561 would exempt vehicles less than five years old from those tests because they are straight A students. The data that we've gotten are 99.65% of those vehicles pass emissions. It's not a novel idea. It's been done in other states, actually California. Langerholk's SB 562 would add seven more counties to the dozens now completely exempt from emissions testing in PA. To say that you're gonna require emissions testing for just those cars in Cambria County, but I live you know, less than a mile from the Somerset County line, they don't need it. And, you know, it it's it, cars going back and forth across county lines. It's not just, this air isn't staying within Cambria County. Both bills passed with bipartisan votes. Philly Democrat Art Haywood, a hard no. When it comes to those new vehicles, he says, trust but verify. The claim that they're not polluting is demonstrated when the emissions tests are taken, not before the emissions tests are taken. And so we need to have verification that there's no polluting. Also likely opposed, though not publicly, the folks collecting the 40 bucks a year to conduct those tests. It's why, you know, government sometimes gets a bad name. You enact all these taxes and nobody ever talks about reducing them or eliminating them. This bill has passed the Senate in the past, but is stalled in the House. Perhaps this year they will, pardon the pun, get it in gear. At the State Capitol, I'm Dennis Owens.